This is one of several problems that students are asked to complete on this test that asks them to draw a free body diagram of the situation and then they use the information from that free body diagram to calculate net force and use that to solve either acceleration or mass and in this case they're finding acceleration. And so I had some students that really followed the free body diagram and going through the entire process, but then I had other students who didn't draw the free body diagram. Um, some students really understood that it was taking the applied force minus the frictional force and that the normal and the weight were going to cancel out. And so all they had to focus on was doing the applied minus the friction to find the net force. But then I had other students who just took some numbers and subtracted them, um, had some students use 3000 um, as uh, not as a mass, but as a force. And so I think Something that I would add in the instructions for this problem would be to draw a free body diagram first and maybe even give them points for that uh, in order to make sure that students do that part because it's an important part of the process for them to be able to understand how to get net force and then eventually acceleration or in other problems mass.